live again at the command center JW Solo USA. I have a package here and let's unbox it really quick and see. Um, today, what we have here, all right, is our fluke meter. Guys, this is the second fluke um, I talked about. Like I bought a new one. This is the fluke clamp meter. It's a fluke 322 clamp meter. Let me bring you close and see it. The fluke 322 clamp meter. So this is a clamp meter. I bought the other one, the 101. And uh, I have some some of my viewers uh, saying they don't like. Some of them they prefer the clamp instead of the um, the one with the wires. But this is the same. You use both clamp and and the stuff. So this is what it is. Move this one aside. And uh, this is a used one. Came from my boys. I just want to show you. And um, so this is the second clamp meter, the Fluke 322, right there, 322 clamp meter. This one can do, uh, it's a Cat, Cat 3, look at it right here, it says right there, cl cl uh, Cat 3. is a cat 3 and uh, 600 plus volt okay 600 volt 400 amps see that now cat 3 here 600 volt 400 amps so this is a kind of beefy one um, if you're thinking about getting the uh, meters um, for your lithium batteries, make sure you get some good meters that um, if you want to calibrate your system. I'm not saying you can't use any meter. I'm not here to tell you what to do. But um, I would suggest or I would recommend we all be using all other meters. But um, so far so good the readings about fluke meters. They're awesome machines. They're uh, super accurate. So because of that, I would like to encourage you guys, the Fluke meter is just an awesome machine. And um, I just calibrated my system, which um, I didn't make a video of. I would have shown you guys how I've done mine, and uh, you can do yours as well. So according to readings and findings, everybody, if you want an accurate reading, you got to get a Fluke meter. And this has been in my mind for so long. I have very good uh, meters. And some of them I've shown you guys. Some of them haven't. Um, because it's not about uh, meters. My focus was not on meters. But now I have to show you guys. I have two of them. The first the Fluke 101 is uh, really cool. And um, it's a, a pocket size. This is a used one, but hey, I don't mind. It works. It uses two AA batteries and is made in um, Taiwan. All right. They, um, I think they kind of have a, a thing with um, other countries to make stuff for them. But um, I was looking for the one made in the USA. I don't mind having the Taiwanese. Instead of having a Chinese made. Now, I'll go with this um, Taiwanese one, which uh, I'll recommend. And because they tend to be, um, they have better products. They manufacture, the product is kind of better than uh, going through Chinese. Alright, if you want to get a Chinese, go ahead and get it. But I'm not getting it. So I got my... This is a Taiwanese, the other one is a USA. I suppose, I think it's a USA one. So, all right guys, well, it's the same te technology, just made from different people. But um, still, if it's just for the, I would have bought a Chinese uh, whatever, fluke, but I never wanted to. 
but I chose this one because I got this one um, for my guys and I think it is, uh, it's going to work and I can use 